One of the most fascinating and, and revealing objects in the museum to me uh, is this scroll, this illuminated scroll that Dickens had made and framed and hung in the hall of his last house, his last home, Gads Hill in Kent, which he was enormously proud of. It was the first property that he owned the freehold of. But what was important to Dickens about Gads Hill was that it was the setting for a very famous scene in Shakespeare's play Henry IV, uh, in which um, Falstaff uh, and his gang rob some pilgrims going to Canterbury. Now this is of course an entirely fictitious episode which Shakespeare made up and it's part of the play King Henry IV Part I. But Dickens is not interested in the life of Shakespeare, or who, whether Shakespeare himself ever uh, came to Gad's Hill or knew Gad's Hill, but he is thrilled uh, about the connection with the play, with the imaginary incident created by Shakespeare, the memorable, wonderfully funny scene uh, of Falstaff attempting to, uh, and his gang attempting to rob the pilgrims and then being frightened away and, and running off. So Dickens has this beautiful illuminated scroll made, uh, quoting Falstaff, tomorrow my lads at Gad's Hill, there are pilgrims going with fat purses and so on. He has that uh, beautifully illuminated, as you see, uh, and framed and hung uh, in the entrance hall uh, to Gad's Hill, indicating this great link with Shakespeare, but not Shakespeare the man so much, but Shakespeare the creative artist.